Everton are confident that David Weir won't be out of action for long after he was knocked unconscious in the cup game with Luton. Veteran defender needed hospital treatment, but he's expected to be back in a couple of weeks. The Premiership side east to a 4-0 victory. Would have been more, but for Mikel Arteta's missed penalty. Well, it was his free kick that led to the first goal, though. Julian Lescott headed in for Tim Cahill to finish. Scoring his sixth goal and what's been a good season so far for him. His second in the Carling Cup. Well, shortly before half-time, Luton's uh, Dean Morgan hit the post from a free kick. When the ball came back in, Weir and Leon Barnett clashed heads. It looked bad, but as replays show, it's uh, an accidental, accidental collision. Weir completely knocked out, lay on the ground for some five minutes as a medical staff assessed his condition. Of course, everyone around the ground was looking on anxiously. Taken off on a stretcher in a neck brace, he was taken straight to hospital where he regained consciousness. I'm sure Everton will give us an update later on today, but this is what Alan Irvine had to say after the game. He's okay, um, but he's gone to hospital where he'll stay overnight. Um, he'll have all the, the tests that are required, but of course with him being unconscious, then it means we lose him for a couple of weeks. So uh, that's disappointing and it's, it's uh, a problem for us because we... We already have uh, a few injuries which are, are long term, so uh, we could have done without any more. And the, the main thing though is that David's going to be okay, and uh, you know we just have to get on without him just now. We have to give Everton credit as well. Um, they've, they've performed tonight, and um, it was never going to be easy for them because um, they were expected to win. So um, I'm not. It's not the end of the world. We're we're disappointed that we're out of competition and uh, that we didn't perform the way we feel we can. Um, but you know we can concentrate on the league now and uh, look forward to Ipswich on Sunday. What